Hi, I'm Josh, the lead writer at the Eco Experts. And I'm Charlie, the editor of the Eco Experts. And today we're going to talk about putting solar panels on flat roofs. Charlie here is the man with the know how, and I'm going to start off by asking you can I put solar panels on a flat roof? Yes, you can. People normally picture solar panels on slanted roofs, which is where they perform best. But if you have a roof that's flat, you can still put solar panels on there. That's great news. What if I don't use mounting equipment? If you have a flat roof, normally you should use mounting equipment because you can prop a solar panel up at about 40 degrees, which is the optimal angle. But if you have a flat roof where you don't want to use mounting equipment, so you want to save on money, or for some reason your roof can't support the weight of the mounting equipment with the panels, you can still have them completely flat. So how much electricity do they produce? Flat roof solar panels, if you mount them on equipment, will produce the same amount of electricity as a normal set of solar panels, which is about 50% of a house's electricity needs. If you don't use mounting equipment and they're completely flat, they'll still produce electricity, less than 50% of your needs, still more than if you have mounted solar panels that are east or west facing. What if you have walls on the outside of your roof, just like little parapets? I mean, that's when mounting equipment is essential because you need to lift up the solar panels to a level where they're not covered by parapet walls. Otherwise, as the sun moves through the sky, shading will go in your panels and will affect their output. So what are the main advantages of having solar panels on a flat roof? There are three main advantages. Uh, one is if they're installed on a flat roof, you probably don't need scaffolding, which means the installation is quicker and when you need to do maintenance and cleaning, it's easier to access. The second thing is without scaffolding, the installation is probably cheaper. You'll normally save somewhere between one and 3,000 pounds. The third thing is the advantage that all solar panel installations have, which is that they cut your energy bills and reduce your carbon footprint. Brilliant. Are there any disadvantages to having solar panels on your roof? Sadly, yes. Uh, if you have solar panels on a flat roof without mounting equipment, so they're completely flat, whenever it rains, uh, water won't run off the panels very easily. So your flat roof solar panels are going to get dirtier more quickly. The other issue is more long term. Um, after about 20 years or so, water is going to start building up between the modules and the roof, which will start to cause some damage. Right, I see. Do I need planning permission if I'm putting solar panels on a flat roof? It depends. If you're getting solar panels on a flat roof without mounting equipment, so they're going completely flat, you don't need planning permission usually. It's still worth checking though. If you are getting mounting equipment, you do need to get planning permission, but it doesn't normally take that much effort. Are flat roof solar panels the same as regular solar panels? Yes, uh, even though they sound like they might be different, the panels you put on a slanted roof are identical to the panels you'll put on a flat roof. Perfect. Charlie, what is our final verdict on putting solar panels on flat roofs? Is it worth it? Yes. If you don't have a slanted roof and you only have a flat roof and you want to get solar panels, we say definitely go ahead and do it. Make sure you get mounting equipment because it will enable you to put your solar panels at the optimum angle. And if you manage the optimum angle, you're probably going to get about 75% discount on your electricity bills. Wow. Wow, indeed. So it's definitely worth it. Brilliant. Uh, well, I've been Josh. I've been Charlie. If you want any more information about solar panels, insulation, heat pumps and other eco products, just go to the ecoexperts.co.uk and we have all the information you need there.